Hi guys, today I'll be reviewing the all new Strange and High minifigures. Now, if you don't know what Strange and High is about, go ahead and check out the CBC website. If you don't want a spoiler, then skip ahead now. Okay, it's all about a boy called Mitchell Turner. He goes to a school called Strange and High. He meets two new friends, Becky and Templeton. Becky, Becky's a bit weird and she is with making the environment tidy and Templeton is crazy and he can easily get confused between TV and reality. Okay, let's get started. So here's the blind bag. You get one card with it and a minifigure. Will it be special? Who will you get? Here's a job you can get. Collect. Let's see what I got. So I got one of the twins. Here's a collector's card and a job you can get. Okay, so let's see who I got for my second one. Cool, Sammy's, Sammy's Speed Special one. Let's get this bit off. Now let's move on to the blister back boxes. So this is the first one. It includes Mitchell, Stephanie and Mr. Abercrombie. Mr. Abercrombie is an exclusive figure to this set. This open. Let's get these figures out. Okay, so first I got these from Toys R Us. The three set the sets are six ninety nine each and the blind bags are two pounds. Okay, so let's look at the figures individually. I love this figure. There's a bit of scuff in the white bits of the coat. This is the back of it. The jeans are very well done. He looks exactly like he does in the program. Sadly, there's no articulation on these. Okay, this is a Mr. Abercrombie figure. This is his size comparison against Mitchell. He's very good. It's very good as he is an adult, but I think he could be a bit more taller. I really like his coat, how it is painted. This is the back of him. I really love the buttons on his arms. Sadly, he doesn't have any articulation at all. Okay, this is a Stephanie figure. It's very, very good. So, this is very well done. It does look exactly like she does in the program. This is the back of her. This is my next set. It includes Becky, Bishop and exclusive Murder. Okay, this is the Becky figure. I love the detail in the glasses. But in the program, her skin tone is a bit more lighter. Her coat looks awesome, and I love that they've added the blue Peter badge. Sadly, there's no blue boat. This is the back. They've done the sculpt really well. I didn't think it would be this good. I absolutely, absolutely think this is one of the best figures. Okay, this is the exclusive Murdoch figure. His head is absolutely awesome. And I love the sculpt of his hook. I think this is really good, but he's really tall. I think they could have made Abercrombie a bit more bigger. This is the back of him. I love that they did do it all the way around. They only did it on the sides. Very well done. Brilliant. But no articulation again. Sad. Okay, this is the Bishop figure. It is awesome. I love the bling. I really love the way they've done that. They've added his cast, and they've done it in his normal and in his pose set, which he normally does. His sculpt is really good, and he's brilliantly painted. I absolutely love it. I can't wait to start playing with him, and I can't believe that they've done so well on his coat. I love the colour of it. This is my third pack. Let's get this open. The first includes Templeton, Quidonia, and exclusive Nimrod figure. How cool is that? Let's get 
glasses is to help with this. There we go. Okay, I am so, so amazed at how they did this Templeton figure. It's awesome. I love the detail in his pockets of his ruler and pens. And also his feet. The socks are odd. Also exactly the same colours in the programme. Awesome. This is the back of him. But he's a really small figure and thin. But never mind, he's still brilliant part of my collection, the strange and high figures. Okay, this is the Corridonia figure. I am so happy at how it came out. Look at the detail on the hood and the jeans. It's awesome. Look at her eyes. They look very good, just like they're on the program. I love the detail to her coat. Okay, this is the best figure ever. Oh my god, this is the Nimrod figure. It is awesome and I also love how they put it in the packaging with Templeton just in front of it. It's awesome and look at the detail on his head there where it says Nimrod Compact. It's awesome. But also how much painted him all blue? They've painted the side and back of him silver but this is the best bit look at that lovely detail on the back of it i'm so surprised that they've managed to do this i only wish they put um as good detail on this figure on some of the other figures which don't have that good detail and i love the wheels on the bottom they're awesome said that if they did bring out figures they should bring out an Nimrod figure. I love it. This is definitely the best figure out of the whole set that I've got, whole series that I've got so far. My Strange Too High figure collection. This is my favourite Nimrod. The boxes are $5.99 and the lion bags are $1.99. I will also be reviewing the, um, Doctor Who, Torture, Sarah Jane Adventures, Primeval, stuff like that. And also, I'll be doing some loom stuff. Hope you enjoyed this. Comment, rate and subscribe.